the end of Bin Laden is a great piece of news for the free world. It's a great achievement for the security forces of the United States of America. It's a great achievement for the President of the United States, Obama. This man was a mega murderer. He killed thousands and thousands of people. People who were totally innocent. And he would continue to kill. His purpose in life was to kill anybody that doesn't belong to him. He tried to murder persons, to murder people, to murder nations, including the state of Israel. And he reached his end. I want to say that while terrorists and murderers are so dangerous, we shouldn't fall victim to believe that they are immune and eternal. They are weak, they are wrong, they are foolish. And we don't have to stop fighting them day and night in order to enable children and women and men to live without any danger of losing their life because somebody has a crazy idea in his mind. I do not know who is the Lord who has permitted Abu Bin Laden to hate, to kill, to murder. None of us know such a permission from any moral authority. The world will become a better world without him. Doesn't mean this is the end of all terrorism and all dangers. But one that was an outstanding murderer reached finally his own justified end. <laughs>